I'm Erin Bergevin and I've been working at Seward Child Care Center since 2011. My name is Gina Salverson and um, I've been teaching in early childhood since 1998. Well, the Families All Matter curriculum is an anti-bias curriculum that we use. It starts out with understanding feelings. So we help children identify feelings in themselves and in others and you know what that looks like, why somebody might be feeling a certain way. Eventually we extend that on to other topics such as families, um, seeing similarities and differences between people. And that's really what it's all about is understanding that everybody <coughs> is different and that's a wonderful thing. In here we have um, we have some persona dolls. The doll that we have in our classroom is named Dang, and his family is Hmong, so they speak Hmong at home. Mm -hmm. And so the children learn all about Dang's family. They learn a little bit about his heritage and language. And that's what we call a window. You know, that's a window into something that they may not be very familiar with. You know, they also see a lot in terms of mirrors with the Persona doll. They see, oh, Dang really likes to play with blocks. He really likes to eat pizza. <laughs> you know, he, he has a lot in common with us. And they really start to bond with the Persona dolls. Often Dang will come and help us solve a problem. The children are always so excited when the Persona doll comes for a visit. Yeah. And they remember, you know, Dang's a little bit shy, so Let's, let's be quiet, let's listen to him, let's make him feel that you know, we really like him to be here and we, we want him to know that we like his visits. Mm -hmm. If we have maybe a recurring problem in the classroom, Dang might come for a visit. But you know what, they came here today because Devin and Dang, they had a problem yesterday. Oh, Dang just told me what the problem was. So he said yesterday he was at school and he really wanted to go and play with the blocks. So he went to the block area and Devin was already in the block area. And Devin started to feel a little bit scared that Dang was going to knock down their block tower. So you know what happened? Mm -hmm. Devin yelled at Dang really, really loudly. They said, go away. And you know how that made Dang feel? Sad. Yeah, sad and, and a little bit scared too. Devin. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Devin. so you can see. Do you see how Devin was feeling about that? Mad. They were feeling really mad and they yelled really, really loud at Dang. Remember, Dang gets kind of scared at loud noises. Mm -hmm. So that made him feel sad and scared. And they didn't really know what to do about that. So it sounds like... Their problem was that they both wanted to play in the black area and then Devin yelled at Dang and he got kind of scared and Devin was feeling angry too. Do you guys have any ideas about how they could solve their problem? I think it's not really nice to yell at Dang. So maybe you guys should just not yell at Dang. So you think maybe Devin shouldn't have yelled at Dang? and that maybe they could play together. I have a question. If you don't think Devin should be yelling at Dang, what could Devin do instead? I know. What do you think Devin She's, could do instead? She could say, oh, okay, she guys, could say I'm sorry that I yelled at you. Oh. oh, so if they're feeling sorry that they yelled at Dang, they could say, I'm sorry that I yelled at you. Mm -hmm. What about when, when, Dang, when Dang came over to the block area, Devin started to feel scared that the blocks were going to fall down? What could they do then instead of yelling at Dang? Um, I know if they could say, hey Dang, you can, you can build somewhere else that's very clear. So maybe they could just tell Dang in a regular voice that maybe Dang could build somewhere yeah. else. You guys had some, lots of different solutions that they could talk to each other instead of yelling, mm -hmm. that maybe they could share the blocks, or maybe they could play together. Or maybe they could play in separate parts of the room. Sorry. You know, Devin really likes these ideas that you guys are thinking of. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Dang? Yeah, he thinks that would work for him, too. It's so much more effective and it means so much more to the children when it comes from this persona doll who they really have a relationship.